Welcome, in front of me is a Xiaomi Pad 7 and today I will show you how you can hard reset this device through settings. So to get started open up your settings and then select about tablet and a little bit lower here you'll find factory reset. Now I do want to point out I do only have 17% of battery which I don't know if this will allow me to go through the process but we'll see in a second. Now, when you do that, we'll have a list of data that will be removed by this process. And to be honest, the only thing that you should really care about is things like your music, photos, and user data. Now, user data would include things like contacts, messages, and anything like that. Uh, so, if you have anything of that sort that you'd like to preserve, you can do that to the Xiaomi Cloud if you click Erase All Data. You have the backup option right over here. Uh, but I do want to point one thing up, out. This is going to be done to the Xiaomi Cloud only. So you will not have access to this backup that is being kept on on the storage that Xiaomi has. So if your new device is in the Xiaomi, you lo lose any kind of access to this data, which is kind of BS considering it's your personal data that you no longer have access to. Just because, God forbid, you didn't use a Xiaomi tablet um, or a phone. Uh, so yeah, just keep that in mind. I honestly personally recommend doing a backup of all your data manually to your computer. Uh, this will mean that you can have access to it at any point with any device without any kind of BS restrictions. So I don't recommend going through this, but that's just my personal preference. Anyway, I don't have anything here that I want to back up, so I'm just going to set factory reset. Uh, now it gets stopped by a 20 second timer, so 10 seconds right here before you can click on the next. Uh, it just lets us know that all data will be removed and this cannot be undone and uh, yeah, we'll press on it and make sure all your important items are backed up, blah blah blah, doesn't really matter, I already went over all of this. So after the 10 seconds passes I can click on OK and this will now begin factory resetting the device. Now this process will take about a minute or so to finish up and once it's completed we will be presented with Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible for me. And as you can see the process is now finished and you can set up your device however you like. So if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.